Hi there friends, I'm Nicole. I've lost 130 pounds and kept it off for eight years. And I went to Dollar Tree and I'm gonna make an extreme budget meal plan portion control for easy weight loss. Let's do it. Okay, so for breakfast, peanut butter, and oatmeal, and this is not the fruit. <laughs> this is not the fruit. <laughs> and fruit. <laughs> All right, let's get it in the microwave. Okay, so I'm gonna do one cup of these quick oats. There we go, one cup. I'm gonna put one cup of water in here. Okay, that's one cup of water, but I think I'm gonna do a little bit more just to make it extra volume. Okay, so I'm gonna microwave this, and then I'm going to put a tablespoon of peanut butter in when it's hot, because I like how it gets like really melty in there. So let's do it. Okay, so I microwaved it for three minutes total. After one minute, I gave it a stir, and then I did the other two minutes. Now I'm gonna put a tablespoon of peanut butter on top and I love like when it's really hot it gets like super melty and it tastes so good and I love the oats combined with the peanut butter really help me stay full all day and it's such a good thing when you're eating portion control in a calorie deficit to lose weight the more like volume and like think tricks you can do like mixing the fat and the peanut butter with oats to help me stay full that really helps me so we'll do that and then this is yeah see then what you do oh this is what i love this is like oatmeal and peanut butter was like one of my staples from the very beginning of my weight loss journey because it's tasty and super filling okay so once i get this all cute in there then i'm gonna top it with the fruit okay so let's open this this is fruit cocktail. I love fruit cocktail. It's tasty plus fruit, good for the health. I'm just gonna dump out some of this. Okay, I'm gonna do half a cup. I left a little bit of juice action just so that it flavors the oatmeal up a bit more too. And there we go. Breakfast for cute weight loss. <laughs> okay, I have two cups of water starting to boil for lunch. First, I'm gonna show you the snack. And it is some trail mix. And what I love like is it's got like a cool variety for not being bored. And also because I like to have a wide variety of nutrients, especially when I'm on a budget, I want to get like the most bang for my buck. And this does that. So that is my snack. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how much you get. It's actually a really decent size. And yeah, I love the variety and it really helps me satisfy my sweet tooth and my salty tooth <laughs> with, with all the nuts and fruits and things in there. So that's a snack. And then for lunch, I've got the water boiling, like I said, for these. This is a Mr. Noodle Instant Noodle Pack and it's spicy chicken. And I love having some spice in my food because it makes me more satiated so I don't feel the need to like eat more. And I'm going to be putting some tuna in it and this is flaked light tuna in water. So get this open. Okay, so it says bring the two cups of water to a boil. Um, it says cold water, but Sassy, my bear, he taught me a trick. You put hot water in and it boils it way faster because we're all about the quick at our house. Um, and then we're gonna put the noodles in, cook for two to three minutes until they're separated. And then we're gonna add the soup base and stir it up. And that's when I'll add the tuna too. And the friends, why I'm making this video is because I lost all of my weight with portion control. I have emotional eating, so any sort of tracking of numbers, calorie counting, anything like that, it really threw me off track and triggered my emotional eating. So I started using portion control to lose the weight and that really helped because I didn't have to focus on numbers. What I would do is I would use the serving sizes on the backs of packages as a guide. And so in this case, you know, 43 grams is one serving of this. Um, and that is how I did it. And 
because I was allowing myself to eat a, a variety of tasty food, just less of it, it really helped me stay on track, look forward to what I was doing and get the results that I was looking for. And so that's what I did today when I went to Dollar Tree. Whenever I go anywhere to make a meal plan, like when I went into Dollar Tree, I'm looking for tasty food, but also a balance so that nutrient wise, I've covered everything, but also things that'll help me stay full. So I'm looking for things with protein, things with slower digesting carbs like the oats, um, you know, fruit, veg, anything that I can find that I can put together in a tasty meal plan that's going to help me feel full and allow me to stay on track because I'll look forward to what I'm eating. Do not put the soup in there yet. <laughs> there she is. Okay, and then you just uh, let it do this until the noodles separate. Flink -a -flink. I forgot to say I'm gonna be putting some peas in there as well for veg. Like I said, I'm always looking for a cool balance. And I didn't use all of the peas. So this will have like two days worth for me. And if I really wanted to stretch my budget, like I could do just half the can of tuna. And then, you know, I could do half of this package and have snacks for two days. Same with the peanut butter, the oats. The peanut butter will last me probably a few weeks by doing a tablespoon a day. And then the same with the um, fruit, I could get two servings out of the fruit. And then the oats will last me probably a week if I measure it out like that. So that's where like I could really stretch my budget if I really need to. And if you wanna know more about the exact portions and meals that I ate to lose the weight, you can check out my weight loss eBooks. The links are down below. I have one called the first 50, which is exactly how I lost my first 50 pounds and it's all portion control. Code Nicole will save you 10%. Link is down below. And I also got Hold this is the HTLT Sups. They just came out with this. A lot of friends often ask me like what I put in my coffee. Well, this is the G coffee creamer. It's mocha latte flavor and it's cool. It flavors your coffee, but with benefits. So it's got three and a half grams of milk protein and it also has nootropics, which help with like focus, memory, mental clarity. Code Nicole will save you 10% and the link is down below for that as well. Okay, so they've been cooking. They're all separate. Did about three minutes. I'm gonna pour the soup base in now, like so. And then I'm just gonna mix this. Oh my gosh, does it ever smell good? And you know what's cool? There's five grams of protein in this. So I'm just gonna stir this around, let the noodles soak up some of the flavor, and I will drain out some of the water and then make like my tuna noodle cuteness. So I just drained a couple tablespoons out cause I like it more, you know, like a noodle casserole -y thingy, but you, you know, oh yeah. Now I'm gonna put the tuna in, put a cup of peas in there and stir it all around, break it up. And that is a veg protein loaded meal. Okay, so for a snack, I chose one of these. This is a Slim Jim original, and what I love about it is that it's got a really decent amount of protein. Like, on the box in the store, it said five grams of protein, so that's why I selected this one, because that protein really helps you stay fuller longer, because it lowers your hunger hormone ghrelin. So that's my snack, and then for dinner, I'm going to be doing rice, with beans so i picked this country chicken flavor rice and then some mixed beans and i like the mix because again the variety and beans can be good protein especially if there's not a lot of meat around and then i'm going to serve some veggies on the side and i chose the garden medley so that i could get a variety of veg and this one has beans corn and carrots so you're supposed to mix the rice in with one and three quarters of a cup of water and then bring it to a boil. So you do the rice and then the flavor packet. Uh -huh. All right. Ooh. Stir this up. Oh wow, that smells amazing. Like the chicken soup I used to eat when I was little. Okay, so we're gonna bring this to a vigorous boil, then reduce the heat to medium-low, cover and boil it until all the water 
is absorbed, so about like 20 minutes. And then I'll show you the portions. So I'm gonna do a cup of this veggie mix. And again, I could have done like three quarters of a cup and done it for two meals. And look at friggin' gourmet carrots. So one cup on the side, microwave it. I'm gonna microwave it for about a minute to heat it up and uh, get my beans out. I love these tops too. You don't need a can opener. You need muscles though. <laughs> Okay. No. There we go. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna rinse these. While the rice is cooking, I'm gonna show a bonus that I found. The Dollar Tree that I was at, it didn't have any milk, but they did have fat-free pudding mix, and that's one of the staples from the very beginning for me, because um, it's important that I include a dessert. If I don't have dessert, I'm not gonna stick to it. So, if you wanna make this and you have milk, then, um, you know, what I like to use is the almond milk because it cuts down on calories. And Costco is actually where we get our milk from and it's pretty cost effective, you get a ton. Um, so what I like to do is I like to use, it calls for two cups of milk. When I use almond milk, I use one and a half cups because I find the almond milk's a little thinner and it won't get as thick. So I'm gonna mix the whole package of the white chocolate fat-free pudding mix. And this in Canada is also sugar-free. Yes, it doesn't say that, but it is. So I'm gonna do one and a half cups of the almond milk. Need a little more from the other jug. There we go. There we go. Okay, and then I'm just gonna whisk this up and allow it to thicken while our rice continues cooking. All right, it is ready. I have drained the extra water. Scoop it all in the bowl. Beautiful, that is looking lovely. So now I'm going to add my cup of beans, mixed beans to it, and just give that a little stir so it all gets mixed in there. And the flavor of the chicken will flavor everything up really, really lo lovely. There, this is beautiful. So, there we go. Got a bag of that lovely rice, one cup of the mixed beans, and one cup of the fancy mixed veg. All right, so for dessert, the bonus of the pudding, that's a whole package. If you wanted to cut it down, you could obviously divide that into two servings and have it for two days. I'm going to have some cookies with it because I always had some sort of like pudding or locale ice cream with some cookies. Coconut is my favorite, the dare break time. So I'm gonna do two of these and I'm just gonna put those in there. Oh yeah. That looks beautiful. And then with my dessert, I usually have a diet pop. I drank a ton of pop at the beginning of my journey. I didn't want to give it up, so I choose diet now. The Zero Sugar Cherry Coke, if you've never had it, bees knees. So that will be my lovely dessert. Okay, so I got my oatmeal with peanut butter and fruit for breakfast. And the friends, if you do have some extra money and you want to add a little more protein, Hoodalt or HTLT subs just came out with this Collagen Plus. They have two flavors, homemade vanilla and chocolate milkshake. There's 20 grams of protein per scoop, plus it's got collagen in it. So it's for skin, hair, nails. You guys always ask like, why is my skin and hair so healthy? Because I take collagen, but now it's a two in one. Um, code Nicole will save you 10%. The link is down below. And you know, a tub will go a long way. So if you, you know, you do have a little bit of money, per day, 20 grams of scoop, help you stay full, especially with meat being so expensive, and you want a two-in-one, there you go. Snack, the mixed nuts package for lunch. My spicy chicken tuna noodle bowl with my tuna, my peas, and the spicy chicken McNoot Mr. Noodles. Snack, a Slim Jim, snap into a Slim Jim. For dinner, I have my chicken flavored rice with one cup of beans and some mixed veg. And then for dessert, white chocolate pudding with two coconut cookies and a Diet Coke or Coke Zero cherry for a drink. The friends, weight loss, it doesn't have to be a punishment. 
and you don't need to spend a lot. If you don't have a lot of money, you can diet on a budget. I've always been on a budget since before I started my weight loss journey. I'm always finding budget friendly foods that I can enjoy in portion, that are low cal, that I look forward to eating so that it makes weight loss easier. You're allowed to love it. You're allowed to do it within your budget. You don't need clean, organic, grass-fed cows and oats and things to lose weight. You can do it however much budget you got and eat eating the foods that you love. Also, I drink as much water as I want throughout the day. Usually with every meal, I'll have a bottle of water and that keeps me hydrated and my body functioning properly. Watch this vid and this vid for more sustainable weight loss tips that are fun for real friends losing weight in the real world. We love our food. We love what we're doing. We wake up every day and we enjoy what we're doing and that's why I can stick to it and keep it off for as long as I have because I do it on a budget with cute food. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate your support. I will catch you in the next vid. Cuteroni, peace. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't